Hey right, folks, it's Dirty Dan. Uh, you know how it is over here. We're just gonna go through the patch notes. <clears throat> just gonna do it really quick, cut format, and let's go. If y'all saw the reveal panel, y'all will have seen the introduction of the what's it called again? Proximity alarm. The proximity alarm. It pretty much just alerts people. You throw it on the wall, and I think actually the whole team. It makes a loud noise when you step within the range of it. Castle will be receiving a proximity alarm instead of his impact grenades. I hate that actually. I wish that wouldn't happen. Caviera's bulletproof camera will be replaced with a proximity alarm. Goyo's impact grenades are gonna be replaced with a proximity alarm. Rook's bar bro Okay, I'm just gonna start calling it an alarm now because it seems like we're saying a lot of that. Rook's barbed wire will be replaced with an alarm as well. Whammy's barbed wire is gonna be replaced with an alarm. Tachanka's deployable shield will be replaced with a proximity alarm. That actually seems like a goofy change, but remember Tachanka is getting that rework eventually. I don't think it's this season that he's getting the rework, but eventually he is. Mira's barbed wire is going to be replaced with the alarm. Oryx's bulletproof shield will be replaced with the alarm. And the recruit's primary gadget will now be the proximity alarm. Okay, now we see our wonderful Maestro and Alibi. On their ACS-12, which is their shotgun, apparently the ammo type is gonna be replaced from like shells, as in like buckshot, to slugs. The damage will be increased from 27 to 41. However, there's just gonna be less pellets flying out. And the damage drop-off distance is set to 18 meters. So past 18 meters, you will have a damage drop-off. Ella's Gershmots and Zofia's Concussions will no longer affect your sensitivity. Echo's Concussion will now last 10 seconds, and originally where like his effect would go away sooner if you stood still, that now doesn't have any effect anymore. Whether you're moving or standing still, his effect lasts 10 seconds. Apparently now they've made the cut. Cuck, cuck, cuck. Apparently now they've made the concussion ability of his drones to be similar to that of a different concussion. I'm not sure what that means, but I reckon we'll see. And his deployable shield will be being replaced by impact grenades. Now Finca. Whenever she revives people with her adrenal surge, they get bumped up to 30 HP rather than just 5. Alright, Callie's pistol, which is the P226 Mark 25, this will be being replaced by, by Clash's SMG, which is this one right here. Callie's explosive lance, the fuse time will be 1.5 seconds rather than 2.5 seconds. So now when you shoot her lance at a wall, it'll take a second less to do its effect. Additionally, her CSR X300 will have her less screen climb every time she takes a shot. You know, when she takes a shot and it just goes like, Hoop! It'll have less of that now. Good heavens, I have been waiting for this one for such a long time. Nomad will be receiving the same pistol as Capitel which is this PRB-92. Additionally, Kaid will also be receiving a revolver that is the same as the GIGN's. When Oryx uses his ability, it'll now only do 5 damage to you rather than the 10 it used to do. Also, Oryx will be getting an angled grip for his MP5, which means that his ADS time will be a lot quicker if you have that equipped. And now, they will be bringing her back down to 3 Candelas. Amaru now when she uses her hook, it'll destroy the window as she goes through it rather than destroying it as soon as you deploy the hook and then flying through a gaping hole. Also, she will now be able to go up hatches without having the hatches broken first. And she will be recovering faster when landing, meaning as soon as you fly on in, you're ready to go. Anyways, folks, that has been the patch notes for the next season. I'm pretty excited. I think these changes are pretty cool. I think a lot of them were long overdue, and hopefully Ubisoft also works on a couple of bugs that have been happening. Um, I'm, I didn't see it anywhere in the patch notes, but I have been having some audio issues, not too frequently, and, you know, just some headshots that don't count. Doink. Uh, anyways, folks, like, subscribe. I don't care.